This is Mitchell from Gamefront. And this is Shadows of the Dead. This video will cover Act 5-4, the final chapter. Enjoy your supper. After all, it is going to be your last. <laughs> you really think you've won? I like that. And I see you decided to join our revels after all. Care for a bite of my last supper? It's low in trans fat. What are you having? <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. How stupid of me. Who are you having? Why, it's your precious Paula, of course. Mm. <gasps> the skin is so soft and tender. Try some. Wait, Garcia! Don't shoot! Done. Oh no, you killed her again. How could you? <laughs> Fuck you! You are dogs! You see, only the prettiest women look radiant in red. This woman belongs in the Lord of Demons' bed. No! She will not be returning to you. Paula, you hold on for me, baby. I'm getting you out. Garcia. This meal is over. Look out, G. We made it to the final showdown against Fleming, and really, despite being kind of long and drawn out, it's not that difficult. All throughout, you should be shooting him in the head with your hot boner, picking up ammo from, uh, from the red boxes along the edge of the circle whenever you need to. The one time where you should stay your weapon is when he opens his coat and reveals Paula. If you shoot her accidentally, you'll instantly lose a battle. I don't know why it's not like she has been killed 500 times throughout the game, but whatever. Anyway, Fle uh, Fleming likes to attack the uh, red lightning bolt that comes out of its head. It's pretty easy to see coming and roll out of the way of once the electricity is fully charged at the top of his head. Uh, his other big attack is a shockwave maneuver that you'll be able to see coming when he floats up into the air and then slams his staff down. Just roll over the shockwave and it won't move. When he makes it dark, look up towards the ceiling and try to anticipate the swinging of the goat head so you turn the lights back on. Once you deal enough damage to him, he'll hunch over for a bit, giving you an opportunity to put an explosive hot boner charge on him. Explode it, and he'll split into three pieces. Take out the dentist now, and lock onto the red glowing part of his body. Unload all you have onto it once it's locked on, and eventually it will go down. Repeat this process three times, one for each body part, and Fleming will go down for good. Now I'm horrible at this, but when he brings up this green shield, you need to bring out your uh, shotgun, skull fests, I don't know what it's called anymore. 
but you need to lob a skull into one of those holes. And if you can do that successfully, uh, you'll actually be able to move right onto the floating body part part. Right after you explode his chest. That's it. Happily ever after. Thanks for watching our walkthrough for Shadows of the Damned, and please don't forget to like, comment, and... Oh! Never mind. We're not done yet. One more chapter left.